Slatin had stopped weighing herself after her son Gage was born 11 months earlier. And she discovers she's now 275 pounds. Amy Slatin had two big goals in mind when she first started filming 1000 LB. Sisters, she wanted to lose a significant amount of weight. Also she could make her dreams of becoming a mom come true, and she was able to do both. Though sooner than anyone expected, after losing some of her 406 pounds and qualifying for weight loss surgery, Slatten quickly got pregnant and gave birth to her son Gage. She and her surgeon, Dr. Charles Proctor, recall in this exclusive clip from Monday's episode. When I first met Amy, over two years ago, she weighed over 400 pounds and one of her goals in life. Not only to get married, was to have a baby, and at that point it was impossible for her. Proctor says, now 11 months since Gage arrived. Slatten is back at Proctor's office for a checkup and she admits that Proctor will likely be disappointed in how she's progressing. I'm kind of nervous. Because I don't think I am where I'm supposed to be in my weight loss goal. She says, I avoid the scale because then I'm focused on the number going down. And if I see it going up. It's going to make me depressed and want to eat more, so it's best not to look at it. Proctor is first excited to meet Gage for the first time, explaining that it is very special when it is a goal for somebody to be able to get pregnant when they never could before. But then he turns the conversation to Slatten's weight loss and asks how she's been doing. I mean, for a while I was doing bad, but we were remodeling a new house, so... You know, you can't cook at the new house, so you had to do takeout, she tells Proctor, adding that she hasn't weighed herself in a while. So, last time you were here, a little over a year ago, you weighed 288 pounds, right? Proctor says, you were pregnant at that time. Let's see where you are with things right now. As Slatten steps on the scale, Proctor explains in a separate interview that getting pregnant so early after her surgery with Gage really put a halt on her weight loss. But since it's been 11 months since Gage's birth, I'm hoping that now, she's under 250 pounds. Slatten is below her pregnancy weight of 288 pounds, but not near Proctor's goal. Coming in at 275 pounds, Proctor says in a separate interview that he's disappointed with Slatten's progress. Surgery's no guarantee that somebody's going to not only lose the weight but keep the weight off. And we've seen that, he says. From what I'm seeing, she hasn't put any more effort back into her health. We've pretty much stalled out at this point. 